Hey there everyone, I'm Around the Wheel, and welcome to Limmings for the Sega Genesis. Little pre-episode note here. I'm not complaining, but let's try to keep it down with the with the level spoilers for levels that lie ahead. You know, I would like to maintain some veneer of surprise so that when I see a level, I'll be like, oh my god, what? You know? Let, let's try to let's try to keep the reaction pure and let's not do anything to interfere with that. Now I know that there's going to be a Just a Minute Part 3, and I'm going to be totally expecting it, and I know what it looks like and everything, because people said what title set it used, you know, how much easier it is. You know, I'll have expectations going in, and it won't be quite the same. But I have no such expectations for this level. Two different worlds. But I can't date you, Lemming Man. We're from two different worlds. This is... This looks like one of those uh, precise building exercises that we all love so much. Uh, said I could kill one lemming, didn't it? Uh, let's get, let's get going here. No floaters. So, what's, what's to be, what's to be done with those little button-down lemmings? The, the media darlings. Let's see. Let's, let's dig down from about right here, I think. I think everybody should, yeah, nobody goes anywhere. You could probably save 100% in this one. I don't see, I don't see what the big deal is, really. Let's just get that release rate up so that we can uh, bash out of here thusly. That might be a little that might be a little hard to build up into, but if I can and there's no climbers either. So let's go ahead and uh, I think we need to get everybody out of the hatch first. There is a lot of lemmings there. I hope none of them splatter. Okay, there is no splattering here. Let's let's go ahead and build to end this. There is building to end this. Now Oh, that is absolutely not it. Now we're all going to walk into the water. I wanted you to go to the left. <sighs> oh, man. Oh, what I wouldn't give to have Win Mini back. That was so nice recording that step. <laughs> oh, you turd. You bunches and bunches and bunches of little turds. How dare you? How about now? That's better. Okay, let's get out of here. We need to get a guy building pretty soon here. I think that guy, that might... Let's see. We do need to make a basher go through the bridge here. So, uh, once we've built up significantly high... There we go. Yeah, keep them all out at all costs, please. And he'll go over there. Okay, yes, that makes things a little bit easier. Now we can, uh, now we can build over here and have it not be such a big deal. Okay, so now, where to start from? I think about right this part of the hump might be fine. That should do perfectly, and we can just bounce up and go through the wall. Okay, well, I guess there are two different worlds on two sides of the steel, but as it turns out, it doesn't really matter. Really? I gotta waste a whole nother one on this nonsense garbage? Okay, well, I guess if that's the price of fame, then we'll go ahead and do it. Man, ten builders might be... Ten builders might really be just the limit here. It might be the bare minimum. I don't see why we got seven minutes, though. Okay, I can I can get through that now. That's not so bad. Let's go ahead and bash her here. Wait till he's on the top step. Don't want to shave off that top one at all. So wait till he's right on the toppermost edge there. Hopefully he won't get swallowed up by the trap. Sometimes you can set those off even if you don't quite hit the ball. The little ball in the middle that looks weirdly like a lemming face looking up into, looking up into something. It's... Kind of brutal when you think about it, really. And yes, that's going to be it for bridge building. That is bridge building 101 right there. Let's not... Okay, let's wait for the second crowd to come through. There we go. That patches everything up. And that should get us pretty perfectly to the X's. So go on. Build your bridge. That should get us... Okay, I always worry about them walking up hills. I've had a little bit of bad luck with that so far. But I think they'll walk over that trap just fine. Just perfectly. Oh, yes. Okay, that's much better. That was a much better attempt. Didn't really need the blocker-bomber combination, as it turns out. They set the release rate low enough that that wasn't really a thing. I guess I could have done it and eliminated any prospect of luck, but it just it just seemed like, you know, as long as I can save 100%, why not do it? So just ignore that whole blocker-bomber aspect altogether. Save everybody if you can. Why should anyone limbing be denied life? If I can save him or her at all. Time to get up. Well, it is mid-afternoon, so you are a little late on the draw with that one. But this one is pretty simple, actually. Once you See, you have finite resources, so it does it isn't that hard to really 
pick up on there. So, well, let's see. 92% have to be saved. Ah, yes. There is a reason we get 20 bridges for this. That is the one hard part of the level, actually, I will admit. All right, let's get two guys going here. And they are going to bomb when they're about... Let's see, the, the, the timer can be somewhat finicky, but I'm going to go from about here for both of them. One, that's fantastic. Well, that might be a tad low. Oh, no, no, no. Well, they can actually technically get up in there, so I'm going to go ahead and run with this. So now what we need to do, we need to patch up the hole over here. No! Why'd you fall, you big dumb? Now I can't do this because I need to, so now I need to start over. I didn't think... This would be the difficult part right here. Well, we do need to patch up the hole such like. So now, yeah, so I'm going to need two lemmings to get through that wall. So the fact that one died is pretty much a complete disaster. Damn it! Okay, nobody died this time. That's good. And, as a bonus, I made a much better little hole this time. So now I'm going to start building probably from about right... Where is a good spot to get in on that hole? Probably, like, right here, I think, will get us to it. Get us up to it plenty well. But we also need a guy building from, like, right here. Because we need... When we build up, we need somebody else... We need somebody else building so that we can catch all the lemmings that fall off this bridge once we get to a uh, sufficient height. So let's just have all those guys get going now. And let's crank up our release rate. And I don't think I built from far enough back, actually. This this might be... This might turn into Nightmare Central if I'm not careful. Okay, yeah. Oh, it definitely turned into crazy times with the builder there. Yeah, I don't think I built from far enough back. We'll see, I guess. Well, no, it wasn't far enough away, but I think this one will be. Okay, now we've got a bridge that'll work. And bombing timing is a little different in the Genesis version than it was in the PC version. So... Let's just try back from here for now. Four, three, two, one. Pull up, pull up, pull up! Oh, no, 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 no! All right, so, like, how about right at the edge of the hole here? Four, three, two, one. Get comfy! Okay, that'll probably work. And then just a smidge farther. That's probably going to get right inside the hole there. That's not going to help anybody. Actually, that may help somebody. We can build out of this, because I have spare builders, thank goodness. That, is that going to help in any sort of measurable way? We need to get, speaking of helping out, we need to get the... That actually worked! Oh my god, that is like one pixel away from not helping, but that is it right there. Okay, wow, yeah, and that was some bad bombing too, pretty much, pretty much all around. I can't believe they got in through that, that's... That's pretty crazy. I think everybody was already out, actually. So maybe raising the release rate was a superfluous idea. I don't know. I think so, probably. But still, you know, it's kind of a symbolic thing. It's kind of like... That's kind of your that's kind of your victory lap right there, is raising the release rate. That's how you, that's how you get everybody out. That's how you get everything done. That's how we work around here. That's how we do it. Okay, so next up should be level... Uh, let's see, level 20... I think is what we're coming up on. That should be no added colors or lemmings, and there's no reason why that one shouldn't be in this version of the game. It's short enough, it's smart enough, and doggone it, people like it. There's our 92% exactly. Yeah, no added colors. Oh, hey! They actually changed it to the American English spelling. That is a little unusual. Oh, man, I had the hardest time with this level when I was trying to beat this game. It's one I got really stuck on near the end. But... Let's see. But now, it's not so hard. It's just a matter of uh, sussing things out here. Let's get a guy... Let's get a guy going, like, uh, right near here. No, not the first guy. Damn it, that was... Oh, jeez. More on me. What I meant to say was, let's get the first guy bashing, but then my brain got ahead of my mouth. So, let's see. I think from here we bash... And we want to get a guy going. We want to get him going, like, right there. Okay. And he'll make his way up to the... Okay, yeah. So what happens is... I think I had a guy... I think I did it slightly wrong. I think you're supposed to... Because you're, like, supposed to cut through your little bit there. And then make him a climber. But then that doesn't really help anybody else out. How am I supposed to do this? Has it? Have I really forgotten how to do this? 
I may have. I'll have to look at this a little more closely. Because I thought you would have to hack through the... Let me see. I thought... No, that's right. You run into the edge of the ledge. And then the guy comes back and you mine through him. And then you get a guy to mine... That's where the... Okay, this comes in at the end. Okay, I just got my steps out of order. Alright, let's get this going so that the blocker is as close to the wall as possible. Because it's imperative that I hit... Okay, yeah, now you have to be... You need to be a blocker. Okay, yeah, he's pretty close to the wall. So we can probably hash this out now with Wimming still coming out toward the end. Alright, he needs to hit the wall and turn around. I need to not worry about him so much for now. What I need to worry about... Okay, make sure he turns around is the big deal here. Okay, yeah, that's perfect. Now I need to get him to go underneath the blocker so that everyone else can go to the exit. Alright, I should have guys still spilling out to the... Okay, that should get everybody still going. If I don't mess with the release rate, that should... That should kind of... Okay, whoo, good. I thought something bad was going to happen with that mining tunnel for a second. Okay, now the last guy here... The last guy is the one that I need to do the little mining... The little miner cart thing here. So, get him going. Okay, he's up the wall. And now... He's up the wall. Okay, there's our 100%. I didn't think I had forgotten so easily what that was all about. I mean, it had kind of slipped the old noggin, but and they should have given you way less than five minutes. Maybe it's a psych-out thing. Maybe they make you think it's going to take longer that way. But yeah, that one was devastating to me when I was first trying to solve Lemmings. I was like, what the hell am I supposed to do here? And I almost had that thought coming around the way this time, but not so much. It... It all comes back pretty easily, you know, muscle memory and all that good stuff. Level 21, with a twist of limbing, please. I think that's also an old one. 50, I gotta save 100. I think this is the one, I think this is the redo of Bitter Limbing, where you have a, I think this is the one where you have to do 50 floaters at the start. It is kind of irritating. Yes, that one is irritating, but, uh, and it's gonna be even more so, because you can't raise the release rate while the game is paused, so I'm gonna be I'm gonna be pumping up the release rate a little bit at a time while the game is going. Uh, otherwise, it's pretty much just like Bitter Lemming. It's just just getting all those guys out at the beginning. And I only have one chance with the Basher, so that's okay. Yeah. Other than that, that's okay. This this one this one might be uh, more fun on paper than it's going to be in practice. So let's hit that release rate up. Everybody needs to get going. I can send up a climber. 58's pretty good, but I like him. There we go. That's pretty good. I can just snap to it here. And I want to get them all made into floaters before... Oh my god, that was a close call for somebody. Holy cow. C button, you're falling down on the job. Either that or Mr. Thumb is falling down on the job. I am no thumbs today. Let's see. So, boom... Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, that's the thing I'm afraid of here is uh, losing the thread. Once we get our 50 out, though, I can just send a climber any old way. Okay, yeah. Okay, good. Glad I'm nailing this on the first try. There's there's a definite panic button thing going on here, but fortunately, they're not all... Whoa! Damn it! Ah, oh, that's exact... Uh, I knew something like that was going to happen. You got to, like, freaking mash the button sometimes, and I only missed one. Because, of course, I did. Okay, they're all safe this time. That took way longer than it should have. And I like our chances for getting out of here with the Basher. Because we just got out of here on the first try with the Climber. One thing I do like is that... Okay, let's see. One thing I like, though, is that if you mess up with the Climber, he still won't do anything. Because there's that little jaggedy part there. So, that's kind of nice, actually. And I think if we are... Uh, I think if we're good enough, we can actually manage this with... I think we can actually manage this with three builders if we're careful enough. Well, maybe not, because he'll probably hit his head and uh, build up into that. So, no, I can see why four builders is a necessity, because we're probably going to end up hitting our head there. So, we are going to be using every little single task that we can. So, we'll be right back uh, once we've built our way over to the exit. We have more than enough time for this level as well. Okay, little man is building. Everything should be cool. Let's get out of here. Yeah, let's get out of here. Well, that makes up for the fact that getting all 50 out of 50 guys as floaters took mm, something like 
something like 10 tries? Oh my gosh, yeah. It took actually a while, It was, and it was not fun to watch either, so that is why that's been excised. Yeah, some of you... Some of you seem to be pulling out your umbrella, and others seem not to be. Maybe it's just the way the limbing train looks, but that's how it looks to me, and I find it kind of strange. Kind of like how I find this whole level strange with its foam insulation. Don't touch that, or you'll be turned into an itcher limbing. Let's get on, and let's get going, and I think we got time for one more level today after we succeed with this. There's our triple-digit percentage right there. Doing it to it. Big Willy style. A Beast 2 of a level. What a great one to end on today. That uh, should be the last special level unless there are more more Sinosis tributes in present Sunsoft. I don't know why there would be, but yeah, here's our final uh, tribute level. So we do get to end on a bit of a breather today. 100 Limbings, 85%. I pushed the start button. Somebody said it takes longer to load these levels for some reason. Uh, I'm believing it for sure. Ah, yeah, this is probably also my favorite of the special songs. Get bashing, little guy. Bash through that, uh, bash through that whatever. Oh, this, this one is kind of cut down a little, though. This, uh, it might be a little difficult with the building here, actually. I might have wanted to actually just have him go up through that and then go through the chain if he, if indeed he, uh, actually is able to walk through that. Let's... Do a little test, actually. This might get a little sloppy. Let's see if he can manage that, actually. Uh, if I can end up building up to there somehow. I want to see if he can build through that. And yeah, they sure do. They hit right up on the edge of the level, and they don't stop till they get enough. Okay, yeah, well, this, this is a disaster. Maybe I should just start over and see if he walks up through it. Okay, here he goes. Yes, he can walk through that. Let's just build at the top of the... This is supposed to be a cross. I didn't think Sega had the same problems with occult imagery that Nintendo did, but that's pretty clearly supposed to be a cross, if I remember correctly. Aha! Lemmings can walk on top of flame. I thought this was of debatable solidity. I wasn't sure, but it was definitely a thing worth pursuing. I think this is the route I usually take anyway, so let's get going on said route. Yeah, and then he can just walk up on top of fire. Fire is nothing for Lemmings. They... Well, they can't really stand acid or water. Fire, though, green petrified fire, doesn't seem to be a big deal. Is he going to walk up over that? I don't think he is. Oh, okay, well, that was a strange one. I thought he was going to walk up over the candle for a second, but it turns out not an important detour. Okay, well, he's good and stuck here, so... Okay, I'm going to have to get my bashing down if I want to succeed here. Yeah, I thought that was kind of a weird little part. Um, well, if we just get everybody going now, we can kind of... Oh, whoa, that's different. That is definitely not where the exit was in the original Beast of a Level 2. That's... Okay, let's actually see if we can, uh... Yeah, let's see if we can actually salvage him here. That's a perfect way to do that, actually. That'll get him going back, and it prevents me from having to use a billion builders in the process. Because you don't get too many of them here. It seems to be more of an issue. I think having enough bashers is the issue here, actually. Okay, so I have a few left, and I have everybody walking. Everybody can just everybody can just 99 it up with their bad little selves as we move on here. we got all the time we need, I think. So, one more. I think he'll just walk up over this. Oh, whoa, no. He walked up into... He walked up into weirdo goofy lane. Okay, so I know he falls in there now. So let's just get him. Yeah, there he goes. All right, hit it. And then he'll fall in, I think, another hole. And that should be the last of that. That should be the last of us. Okay. Now, well, I still feel like I need to pay kind of special attention to him. I don't think he's going to just fall right into the exit there. Okay, good. He didn't walk out some mysterious pixel on the other side either. Let's... Okay, yeah, there we go. All right, that's kind of a funky place to put that little thing. I guess that's what's so mayhemy about this level is the kind of is the kind of odd sort of I don't know. There's definitely an edge to the ledge normally in in PC Amiga version, but okay, I was gonna say, do I have enough builders in case he blows through a hill there? But I have 11 builders. That is hardly the problem here. There's definitely an edge there where you have to make a two-blocker trap normally. I think even if I was a little bit resourceful, I could have even saved everybody, but eh, screw that. 
The special levels make it easy for you, they do. But this is kind of a this is kind of a nifty twist what they did there. And I like how there's actually a bit of autumn kind of scattered about this level. Whether well, it looks also kind of bloody, I guess, depending on your point of view. But whether whether you can chalk that up to the Lemon Genesis palette or what, I like it either way. This is probably this is up there with uh, what an awesome level, a uh, a sort of twist that I wasn't expecting on a bona fide established classic. That was a really good one, and that's gonna do it for us today. Next time we're gonna jump into level 23. Nothing special for us from now on, except scads and scads of new levels that we will not even be able to contain the awesomeness with our weak mortal brains. I will see you guys next time.